Hello, this is Charlie Mason, or Furries Are Cute. Many of you may have been wondering where I have been, and some of you have been worried about me. Me. That's you, anime cat fan and gamer. You're all very good friends, and I'm sorry if I worried you. And to all of those who have continued to leave me hateful messages in my absence, well, only God can help you. In fact, God, well, that's the reason I've been absent for so long. While, I'm, while I have been here on YouTube, I've let a lot of comments on other people's videos that I'm not really proud of. People who were of the homosexual nature were called on to, into question by me. I've said some really nasty things to them. I told them that God didn't approve of their love. I told them that they'd go to hell or that God hated them. And a lot of people hated me for that. And even to this day, a lot of them followed me and harassed me daily even after I stopped talking about it to them. And that's, that's just not right. There were some other people, some other Christians, who really got me thinking about what I believed, and which led, eventually led to my absence, which I have been. Some of them said that homosexuals were all right in the eyes of God. I thought of that. How could other Christians believe that God said something else when Jesus had visited me personally, which is what I thought. That's how I was gone for so long. I've been praying and talking to my pastors. I've just been very deep in thought. I've had a lot of questions on my mind. And, well, I finally made up my decision. This is what has occurred to me after hours and hours of deep prayer. I realized that when Jesus first visited me and told me that homosexuals did not actually love each other and that their lives were sinful, I realized that that wasn't actually Jesus who was speaking. I realize now, with speaking for my pastor and my friends and family, and from deep prayer, that that was only a manifestation, a hallucination, from my preconceived bias against homosexuals. From the original trauma of my first experience of Christ, from my first hallucination, that was from my hatred, not from Jesus' love. I realize now that homosexuals are not sinners, or at least they aren't going to hell for loving each other. I understand now that people who have the freedom, people have the freedom, I mean, to choose to love who they want, and that is a God-given freedom. God may have said in Leviticus chapter 20, verse 13, but that was for the Jews, not for those who follow Jesus. Jesus tells us to, one lo to love one another. another. I'm sorry, I'm really nervous. They might, they might not have a Christian bond like normal couples have, but their bond is their choice, and we should respect that. <laughs> However, marriage is a sacred institution, and God has defined it as one man and one woman, not two men or two women, or a man and a dog, or something random like, I don't know, a man and a sandwich. You know, that's kind of silly, but you, you get the idea. You know, if you mess with a divine institution like marriage and allow an unsacred union, then who's to m stop a man from marrying a dog? That's, that'd be disgusting. But like I said, I understand that homosexuals want to be together, and I no longer see that as a problem, as long as they don't try to push their agenda onto us. We have freedoms too, and they don't have the right to force their sexualities down our throats. You know, it's like a liberal trying to teach children how to have homosexual sex in our schools. Again, that's why marriage is a sacred institution, and why we shouldn't mess with God's laws. Things like that will continue to happen if we do mess with it. So if you are a homosexual, and I told you that you're going to hell because God does not like your sins, then I apologize. I didn't mean that. I don't mean that anymore. I am sorry for making a fool of myself and of other Christians. I thank mostly anime fan and gamer for protecting me from those cowards who continue to this day to attack me, those who attacked me while I was gone, those cowards who would attack someone whose back is turned. I could not ask for a better friend than you, anime fan. God bless you. Well, this video has kind of been deep, but... I might make some lighthearted videos about some current events or maybe something funny that I saw on TV. If something like that comes up, that, that might be a fun idea that I might entertain in the future. 
well, I hope all my friends here have had fun. So anyway, I'm, I'm back now. I'm not going to be gone anymore. Thank you very much for listening to me ramble on for the past five minutes or so. God bless you all. Jesus loves you. And may all of your days be blessed.